I have always said that Jackson Heights is the, the most diverse community in the whole world, literally. We have 167 different languages spoken here. We are very, very proud of that diversity. Let's salute that and let's all be proud of what we have accomplished here. In almost half a century of documentary making, Frederick Wiseman has become known for his ability to capture the nuances of life. For his latest and 42nd film, he turns the lens on a multicultural neighborhood of New York, Jackson Heights. Neighborhood. Right now we're sitting in which neighborhood? Jackson Heights. Jackson Heights is a neighborhood. Flushing is a neighborhood. Astoria is a neighborhood. Well, I wanted to do a movie about uh, an immigrant community, new immigrants to America, because to state the obvious, America is a country of immigrants, and I wanted to see what this generation, uh, how this generation of immigrants was, was living. Uh, and my father was an immigrant to America at the end of the 19th century. And so I've always been interested in, in the, as the cliche goes, the immigrant experience. Is the immigrant experience isn't the only thing Wiseman captures. Over the course of the three-hour documentary, the audience is given a glimpse of the colorful tapestry of life in Jackson Heights and the issues that affect its residents, from the threat of gentrification. I'm trying to create the illusion, however uh, momentary it may be, uh, uh, that the viewer is at the place. And I try to present enough information in the sequences and collectively uh, in the film so that people viewing it can understand what's going on and make up their own minds about what it is they're seeing and hearing. This is the ninth film Wiseman has set in New York. The 85-year-old currently splits his time between his hometown of Boston and Paris. So what is it about the Big Apple that appeals? All the things that make New York such an alluring city to live in. Uh, and with, I don't know, 10, 12 million people, uh, a lot of, an enormous amount of activity and interest and, and uh, combustion. The doctors want to take a look at you. New York isn't the only reoccurring theme in his documentaries. Wiseman is known for turning the lens on institutions, on everything from hospitals to galleries. Demands, really, to, as I say, to sort of almost meet Christina um, by proxy through the medium of the portrait so that he could... Well, I think the common thread, really, is I'm having a look in making a series of films which nominally take, which take place in institutions about the way we live. Uh, and the wide variety of uh, human experience. I mean, that's what unites all the films is uh, an effort to capture on film uh, as wide a variety of human experience as possible. Wiseman doesn't like to discuss what he's working on next, but the 85-year-old says he has no plans to put down the camera. And it's safe to say we can expect more glimpses of the nuances of human life. Jay Barker, TRT World, New York.